So here's why you should learn to code. When people think of learning to code, they usually think of building the next Facebook or getting a job at one of the big six, which to be fair is a great reason for learning to code or any skill for that matter. If you have a goal, learn what you need to learn and then go and do it. But if you're not wanting to build the next Facebook or become Silicon Valley's latest software engineer, there's still a great reason why you should learn to code. And I'll define it simply as this, being able to take action on ideas when you have them. As a freelancer, I get people come up to me all the time with product ideas that while they seem great, they either don't have the money to build it or they don't know exactly what they want. Now that last point is very important because if you don't know exactly what you want, you're going to have to iterate. And iterating ultimately means that the first version of your product is probably not going to be the final one. You're going to have to build it multiple times, make changes in the future, add new features, which is going to cost money. Because let's face it, it's very unlikely that your idea is going to accidentally hit a home run. I love the fact that I can come up with an idea today, build it, test my hypothesis, and if it doesn't work, I leave it, and if it does work, I run with it. And I can do that hundreds of times in the same amount of time it takes someone who doesn't know how to code to hire a developer so that they can test their idea. So in short, I don't really have to worry about getting it wrong. I don't really have to worry about risking any money because I'm not spending any. Even if you don't have the ability to build your idea, Having a general knowledge of software development will help you to understand all of the processes that are involved in scoping a project, developing features, testing those features, and deploying a project. So my question now is, are you going to learn to code?